breaking the cycle of mass incarceration starts when kids are young. Northern Virginia-based Viapath Foundation is funding some new and existing programs to support at-risk youth. Our Millette Green working for the community is here to tell us more about it. Millette. Good morning, guys. Yeah, one of the local groups getting grant money is D.C. Family and Youth Initiatives. D.C. FYI is a small agency and can use the money to work with teens at a critical stage in their foster care journey when they are older and near aging out of the system. Viapath is giving the group $7,500 in grant support. We try to change that trajectory for the young people we serve to connect them with adults who will be in their lives. Some of them we help to find adoptive families, which is fabulous. Others are connected with mentors and other members of the DCFYI community who are with them while they're in teens and foster care and for those who stay in care till they age out, remain in their lives. And so we know this makes a difference for those young people. So our intent, our hope is to continue to grow and to continue to support organizations who support uh, our mission. And that's basically um, giving people positive experiences, giving them opportunity, giving them recognition, and just um, letting them know that someone out there cares, somebody out there recognizes that they are um, an individual who deserves opportunity. Viapath Foundation has a big pot of money, $140,000 to support their mission. DC Family and Youth Initiatives is asking for volunteer help. Visit dcfyi.org to get more info.